Good. So the stream is back. Sorry, I'm, I'm, I got him. I have Discord, yes. Surprisingly, huh? Okay, let me check. Why is she, uh, he not happy? Minus one for an unknown reason. Sucker. And more scouting. You don't know what Discord is? It's like TeamSpeak, but better. Alright, um, I could promote the war card. Uh, let me do that. Actually, that will help. Yeah, Bubilicious. I'm not quite sure. You are obvious. Oh, I'm worth your time, huh? That's nice to hear. So that's Uruk. I need to go over here and very quick. I want to destroy this before he starts. Look at this. I mean, this has an advantage though. The fact that he has built a village there will keep the other guys from from immediately pushing a settlement there. On the other hand, I want my next settlement to be what did I say? Like here? Yeah, here. I need more mil yes I know that but I want also to get a great profit to be able to push out a religion it's very important too um, I actually where's my slinger is that thing still recovering holy crap I should have attacked this one on the other hand if I let it be these guys will have a lot of fun right they will have a lot of fun so 320 that means I can get the settler Carthage warrior okay so no danger What are you saying? I am worth of her time. Shut up. <laughs> it's not okay. I am worth her time. You know, poster boy smile. Okay. Now, let me pull you into the city. Oh, I didn't even check. Can I upgrade these guys? Signe is a 250 square mile Ooh. tiger trap made up of massive obelisks riddled with jagged spears and yes they will cut your pretty face that's cute whatever it is where is that in the original oh a large army god that was cheap so cheap so cheap <laughs> Not even worth the 41 gold I have here. Mm -mm. Sorry to say that, but... Mm -mm. So he will probably kill that one. And that's fine. And you are going... Here. Whales? Oh no, it's no fish. So this is no whales, it's just fish. That's fine though. I get a Eureka moment if I settle here, right? That's always good. Now, more exploring. I actually thought about... No, I wanted to keep that village. Okay. Let's keep the village.
Archery is nearly done. I shot an arrow into the air. It fell to earth. I, I knew not, not where. where. I like his voice. It's, it's just mm, great. Archery. Without craftsmanship, inspiration and craftsmanship. Is a reed shaken in the wind. I need to be careful here. So what do I need? I need political philosophy. That's what I need. What do I need to get that? I need early empire and state workforce. I think I'm gonna go with early empire. No, hang on. State workforce I have a boost for. So let's take that. I cannot attack this guy, unfortunately. And he will run away because that's what they do. The question is, where will he run to? I will upgrade these guys to archers. Oh, look at all those. So what do I get? Barracks? That's kind of for military. Not bad. Could get horsemen. Yeah, 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 I'm getting city walls. The fact that they are coming right here is concerning. And I want to be able to defend my city. Yep, that's it for him. Welcome to the United Teddy. States of America. If you conduct yourself well, you can consider us friends. Yeah, let's see. It's an honor to meet you, and we would love to sample your hospitality. Okay, you're over there. There's another barbarian village. They will probably have a lot of fun together. My diplomatic delegation should be arriving soon. Yeah, sure. You're welcome. Just come over, have some meat. So now we knew where he ran, right? And yes, I have my scout attack him. Better stay away from these guys. And... We're back. It's good for the upgrade. Although there's not a whole lot of money so far. There will be second city arriving soon. What does the trader cost? I want to go for the trader next. Oh, of course. I shrunk the city by creating the settler. Should have thought about that. So the trader is to 185. Not, not exactly a bargain. Yeah, run away, dude. Run to the warrior over here. Run to the warrior over here. Ugh. Oh, well. That's 30 gold. That's kind of a no-brainer. So... Okay. Can you use the mountains over he or hills over here for holy sites? And maybe encampments as well. Although I would love to have the encampments more directed away from my own cities, like towards this guy. But on the other hand, I plan on building another city, right? So, promote the scout. Faster movement. It is. There we go. Barbarians and scouts. Yeah, he will not be fast enough to catch this one. But he's trying. 
Okay. And you will kill the scout. <laughs> okay, here we go. Ah, oh, he's got incense. She got incense. Interesting. If I get more diamonds, I may be able to trade them for other amenities, right? Here. There we go. We need amenities. The question is, what is my amenity? Oh, from entertainment. How do I get that? How did I get an amenity in entertainment? Does that come with a city size? Or with the money? Okay, I don't know that. So, you... Hang on a sec. If I kill this village, they will settle here, certainly. Question is, will they do that anyway? Let's first cross the river. Holy crap. Should have gone here. If they all attack me, I'm done for. Well, the spearmen certainly did. Okay. That was not perfect. It could have gone way better for me. You heal up. And you shoot at this guy, please. Very good. That was a very good shot. So there's more coast, more fish. Lots of fish. Let me go here, and then try to decide this battle. Okay, so that village is done. Oh, 20 faith. That was good. That was good. And these guys will not be able to catch me that fast. So I might be able... What? I cannot build a city there? Ah, oh, come on. That was not the plan. <laughs> That was not the plan. Um, let me see. One, two, three. I will not get this fish. Will I? No, I will not get this fish. But I want the sheep. But if I settle here, I will get this fish. That works too, right? One, two, three. Only on, on these two fields. Yeah. Now let's build the city here. I knew that would happen. Oh, look at this. This is getting interesting now. What, oh, I can choose a pantheon. Okay, Pantheon, what to do? Production from fishing boats? We will have fish. Monument to the gods? That would get if we go for wonders. That doesn't make sense. Great person point from holy sites. I think that's quite good. could also take that. That would give me even more faith. God of Craftsmen is also very nice. Mines on strategic resources? I already have 
No, copper is a bonus resource, it's not strategic. Ah, this one's also good. And look at this. I don't have anything of this. Or this, so these two don't make sense. 25% production for military units. That would be nice. God of Healing. Border extension rate. Oh, it's all so good. So good. I'm really, I really am torn. I'm gonna go with the military. What? Yeah, gonna do it. Mysticism. That's a boost there. Okay. Let's have a look at the coast real quick. There's some crap. Silver. I don't like this. I mean, I will be able to defend this guy. There he goes. But this, I don't like. Yeah, that was a mistake. That was definitely a mistake. But still, I will get the city. Oh, look at this. Uh-huh. Maybe I should have pulled you guys back. I will kill this unit. That is XP. And I will get the sailing Eureka and my second city. Kish! Which will get a... Oh, I don't have sailing yet. Okay. So I think... I'm gonna go with a trader. Get those quests done. And six turns until I get the Stonehenge Wonder. I can attack this guy. That will give me another XP. And probably he will attack me, but he should not be able to kill the scout in the forest. At least that's what I hope. <laughs> that's what I hope. Oh, he's, he's gone. How fortunate is that for me? And same here. It gives me some time to heal up. He will pull back. You know, these guys, let them just attack Rakadet. That's fine. That is just fine. I love a leader who is surrounded by an impressive military. Here, Rachel, suck it. Impressive leader and impressive military. Thank you, sir. A strong economy begins with a strong, <laughs> well-educated workforce. Okay, I got plus 15 production and maintenance reduction. Now, let's see. I cannot really, you know take that because I want the faith on the other hand plus one production in all city is pretty good and I will get the face from yeah I will get the faith from um, <laughs> yeah no no I'm you you've seen what I what I chose for the Pantheon right higher military production I did that for a reason obviously so what's my next civic? Military tradition would be okay, but it doesn't really help me in my current situation. I want political philosophy. So I'll take early empire. It takes 10 turns. What's here? I need food. Really? What's our problem with food? Let's have a look. Oh, because it's product producing culture. Yeah, maybe we should start with that first. 
and grow the city a little bit. How about that? I know, I know, I know. Where do you come from? And I explored a lot, so what I will do now is pull back a little bit. Arrow storm, raged combat against, yeah, make that even stronger. There you go. Two hundred and forty-eight. Will I do the investment into another trader? I think so. That will give me roads. So, um, oh, I can't. Your civilization needs more trade route capacity. Oh, because I'm building. Ah, because I'm building the trader here. Well, f that's just fine then. Um, let's wait another turn. When I got masonry, I will build the city walls, so you're happy, yeah? Okay. Um, yeah, I think I will stay here for a while. There's another, but that will only go for Carthage, hopefully. And I will pull this guy back to my city. And Kish is about to grow. That's very good. Thanks for keeping the peace on the continent. Bully yeah. For you. You're quite welcome. You're quite welcome, sir. Thanks for keeping the peace. Yeah, yeah. You said that already. Okay. Build a quarry. Yes, I would need a builder for that. Actually, um, hang on a second. I don't really have... Yeah, I could build the quarry. Plus it's a lot of production, right? But the city is... Look at this. I need to grow the city. I need farms. So I will probably place a farm here and a farm there. Yeah, sure, buy it. Right. Did you see how long that will take? I still have one turn and I want to build something else here. Sure. All right, uh, nine turns for masonry. Can you imagine trying to talk 600 people into helping you drag a 50 ton stone 18 miles across the countryside and muscle it into an upright position and then saying, right lads, another 20 like that. Then we can party. <laughs> I like that quote. That's awesome. So I get a free profit. And that means I get drama and poetry boosted. Our populace has attracted a great profit to our lands. Send this most holy person Wait to Stonehenge and rejoice. For the time has come to found a religion for ourselves. Yeah, we will do that. So there's the prophet. Let's go over and found a religion. Nothing happened. Okay, let's choose the production in Uruk. Scroll out a little bit. Um, oh, look at this. I got two quarries that I can build. That's good. Um, bum, 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 bum. If I build a holy site. That does count as a holy site, right? Let's build another archer. Choose a religion. So which... Oh, look at this. There's a lot of religions out there, right? Custom religion. Let's take a custom religion with a peacock. Yeah, that looks good. Um, how do we want to name this thing? Diamantism. And... 
Oh man, there's so much stuff again. Uh, let me see. Produce production for each follower. That's pretty nice. Amenities and city with two specialty districts. Also nice. Temples and shrines provide housing. That could come in handy. All wonders provide plus four faith. All world wonders. Feed the world. Temple and shrines provide food. Equal to the in intrinsic faith output. Okay. Relics have triple yield of both faith and... What is that? Tourism. Tourism! Hmm. That is also very nice. But I don't have any relics. Hmm. I'm gonna go with that. And... I'm gonna go with this. Theology has been boosted. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. That's good. 